Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I do appreciate you coming back. And for those of you who have never been here, thank you so much for popping in to check out this video. So guys, today jumping right into this, in a previous video, I showed you how to disable the dynamic search box. If you missed that, that is popping up about now. But today I am going to show you how to disable search box suggestions. We've all been there. You click on search in your uh, start menu there, you go up here and you intend to search for something locally like a file or a folder or something like that that you have in here. Um, but what comes up, uh, not instead, but on top of that is internet search results from Bing. So say for instance, I mean to just search something in my computer. Let's just say it's gonna be computer, not management, um, but let's just say, I just, type something here. Okay. So as you see, you're getting search results from Bing. And that is the last thing I wanted to see. I wanted to see a local file, a local folder, something like that. Now I, 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 I understand that nobody or most people aren't going to have, you know, something named computer shop or something like that in their computer. This is just an example. So, and we've all seen it to where you go to type something to search for something local and you're getting this. So what I'm going to show you today is how to disable the search box suggestions that scour the web, come up with results, and this is from Bing. Um, so what we're going to do, the way that you do this, guys, you just click in your search box, you'll type reg edit, and you'll bring up your registry editor. Okay, and as soon as this comes up, I'll pop the uh, string or the registry key down there that you need to go to, um, but it's going to be H key current user. And then you're going to scroll down here to software and then policies and then Microsoft and then Windows. And once you're in here, we're going to add, need to add a new key. So we're going to right click on this and hit new and key. And the name of this key has to be Explorer. Spelled exactly how I have it here, capital E, um, on the front of the of on the front of Explorer. So you're gonna hit enter on that. Now, once we're on that new key over here to the right, we're gonna right click and we need to add a new D word value. Okay, and now it's asking for the name. And I'm just going to paste it in here because it's a little easier. But all this information is going to be down in the description below for you guys. And again, make sure you pay attention to the way this is spelled, capitalization and stuff like that, because that is very important for this tweak. So once you get that in there, hit enter. And you're going to open this up. And the value data zero is what leaves the search box suggestions on so we're going to change this to value one to turn it off so once you're done with that we hit okay now for this particular hack or tweak for windows 11 to get rid of your search box suggestions you do have to restart your windows explorer you can restart the computer too but just restarting windows explorer is a lot quicker let me show you how to do that you just right click on your start button and you go here to task manager once task manager is open we got to scroll all the way down to the bottom here to where we find windows explorer it looks like there's two of them for whatever reason so we just right click on it hit restart we see the screen flash like that which is a good indication that it did restart the windows explorer um, now once that is done you will click back in here you will go to your search and if we type the same thing, you can see that there is no more web search. Bing is not coming up trying to suggest something from the web. Again, there might be those of you who really like that, and that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Me, from my personal preference, I just prefer to use a web browser and leave this for local searches. Anyway, guys, that is all you have to do. Again, all the information is down in the description below. If this video helped you at all, please give me a like and or subscribe for future content. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.